since we had such a good performance at WSOE, we have pretty high expectations coming into DreamHack. It's a really cool feeling coming back to Leipzig for the same DreamHack event. I'm pretty sure it's the first time I've ever come back to an event, uh, just for Rocket League specifically. Uh, coming back to the same place, knowing everything and like where everything's at. It's uh, kind of a weird but cool feeling. Um, I think Chicago really brings like a, a motivation to the team. He's a younger guy and he's newer to the scene. And when we were on the team together for two years with the same players, we kind of got stagnant and it's, it's really refreshing with Chicago. Um, yeah, when I came in, everything was super positive, like ready for a new start, ready to grind and um, become the best team we can. So that was just really nice to see. And I'm also like really open to just being positive and funny and making jokes just having a good time. They're all super accepting and like um, just really friendly and there wasn't anything bad blood or anything. It was just a bunch of nice guys just welcoming each other. Day one of Leipzig went really well for us. We ended up 3 one mindset and then went straight into our second series versus Velos and we ended up 3 0 them. So it went really smooth. I think our expectations for day two are pretty high after such a good day one, and I think if we're playing our game, we could easily make it to day three. Just got to be confident. NRG versus G2. This is a long-standing, you know, and maybe not rivalry, but at least one of the best of the best of North America. We've seen them go head-to-head -head multiple times here, and it is going to be awesome. Recently, he's been taking a much more offensive oh. role. Here comes forward. j -Dub's open. There's a score on. Goal lead for NRG. G2, the team in attack, and it's a fast down to Chicago. He's hit the bar again. Bump buzzer. The only energy defender. Chaotic uh, position in the defense. Go for it. Rizzo, for it down again, and now that will be game. NRG have put their place in the next round, and we are going to be seeing them against Pat Dye. We played against NRG, and Despite losing, it felt really good, and Energy's a strong team, so almost taking it against them was a, a good feeling. It was a close series. We felt like we kind of had control, but we just, we were more than a little sloppy on defense, so. And then our third one was against Red, which we felt pretty confident about. Um, we've only scrimmed them. I don't think we've played them in a competitive tournament or anything, but playing against them, it was, I mean, it, it's always fun to play against a new team. It's a great series for G2, and, and it, it definitely is a tougher match to predict than I would like to admit. I'm going with G2. It's oh, my no. boy Chicago. Let's go. He's got what it takes. I believe in it. Time closes down here. He may pick up another. Oh. So pretty by JDAP. Highlight real goal for sure. Yeah, if you can't win, you might as well score the best goal of the game. Look at that air dribble, the double tap. JNAB's going crazy. Just for G2 unfolding. JNAP's off the backboard, gets the demo as well. It's off the crossbar, no one can find it. JNAP does, and for G2. We're feeling really good as a team after day two. Making top eight, or just day three in general, is something that most of the teams here are striving for. So I'm really glad that we were able to do it ourselves. Going into day three, we're feeling good, especially on the side of the bracket we got. We got uh, Savage, which it's not a team we played against before, but me personally, I always like playing against new teams, and since we never played them, it's going to be really fun for me. This is going to be a phenomenal day of Rocket League. Savage versus G2. Very risky play, and now Rizzo couldn't make contact, but there's going to be no one up for Savage. Tried to doink it, but instead it's going to be Chicago's challenge. With the next touch on the ball, this has to be it, and it will be it! Rizzo makes it! One goal for G2 with four seconds left. Other way. Off the side of the wall, Chicago's touch, it's inviting for out! I think uh, in the series, if we had a little bit like better shot placement, we could have taken the series. I don't think we played too bad. It was just a little bit of the execution in the end that really hurt us. Yeah, defeat always makes you think about what you did wrong, what you could have done better. So as soon as you get home, you want to practice even harder, make sure you don't make those mistakes. So going to league play, I want to make land with everything because that's the best tournament in the world. And so I just want to do everything in my power I can to play the best I can possibly do for league play. So that's the main goal right now. So I'm really happy with our performance this tournament, except for the last match, obviously. But I definitely think that's a learning zone for the team because it's very brand new. 
But I'd like to say thanks to the G2 Army for all the support you've shown, win or loss, which is always awesome. So we'll make sure to do you guys proud and practice hard when we get back home.